Let's solve this system of nonlinear equations. I think I can do it by the substitution method. Notice this tells us that y is equal to x. So don't forget all your ordered pair solutions should have the same x and y value. So I'll take this and instead of y, right here, since y is equal to x, I'll write x. So I'm going to write down this first equation, and what do I write down? I write down x squared plus 4 times, now instead of y, since y is equal to x, I'll write down x squared is equal to 5. And I have an equation in one unknown x. What is x squared plus 4x squared? Well, that's 5x squared is equal to 5. If you divide both sides by 5, you'll have that x squared is equal to 5 divided by 5 or 1. Then do not forget your square root property. x is then equal to plus or minus the square root of 1, which is plus or minus 1. So it looks like I have two values for x. x is plus or minus 1. And let's see what happens. So x is positive 1 and x is negative 1. And by the way, we do have this equation y is equal to x. So if x is 1, what's y? Well, y is the same thing. y is x. So y must be 1. If x is negative 1, what is y? y is negative 1. Now check these two ordered pair solutions, but they will check in both equations. So here's our solution. This is an ordered pair solution, and this is 1.